Hoo-ya! Yes, I told you I shall be back in a second. And to you, well, in, in all honesty, it may be a second, or it may be the next video. Who knows? But yes, I am back, and you may be thinking, what the hell? This is just a normal world. This looks worse than your last world. There's nothing in it. Yes, but look up there. <gasps> a floating island in the sky. Oh, yeah. Woo. There we go. <laughs> so, yeah, these are the new vines that I was telling you about. Um... They're like the terraria vines, uh, only you can't actually go through them. But they do get destroyed in one hit, so good because I hate vines! So yeah, this is a sky island. It looks pretty cool. It's a bit boring and there's not a lot on it, to be honest. And I did notice there's a bit of a problem with the generation, where some of them spawn as grass blocks instead of dirt blocks. So it looks a bit weird. But obviously you build your way up here and there's a chest, so you think, yes, I'm getting something good out of this. No, it's just the normal stuff you would find in a dungeon chest. So, it's not that great. It'd be nice if like, there was a chance of it having like um, a phase blade in it or some TNT or dynamite. But, or maybe a potion. But it's got nothing of the new stuff in it. It's just got old stuff. So yeah, so this is a little sky island. Um, yeah, so I'm going to, uh, I think... Actually, I'm going to go back onto my normal world actually because I forgot to show... I'm going to try and get some of the new mobs to spawn as it's new, now getting to night time. So, yeah, I won't be able to show one of them, actually, because it's a new skeleton. Anyway, I just go back onto my normal world and try and get the new... the demon eyes and some of the slimes to spawn. So, back in um, a second again. Yeah. Okay, right, so I'm back. I have put the difficulty onto hard. I've equipped the molten gear, which looks pretty amazing, to be honest. And I've got the molten sword and pickaxe. It's getting to night time, and I am going to go look for some mobs. So yeah, the obsidian skull, I'm not sure if I said doesn't actually protect you from fire or lava. Right, I've turned the brightness up so that I don't have to keep placing torches, as I don't have any. But in theory, if I walk a bit, some mobs should start spawning. That I could also test out the strength of this sword. I probably, oh, look, orange mushrooms! Yeah, I told you they spawn randomly in the world! Jump for joy for the mushrooms. Because we're not in the mushroom kingdom, but there's loads of mushrooms here. <laughs> oh, 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 what the? Oh, this is one of the new mobs. Look, it's a skeleton thing. It's a skeleton zombie style thing. Yeah, you don't hurt much. Oh, it dropped chains. Nice. Okay, so you don't actually have to make chains. Um, I think it's chains. Yeah, an iron chain. The reason- OH SHIT CREEPERS FUCK! Uh, the reason why they drop iron chains is because, uh, you have to kill the skeletons- Don't know why I'm destroying the grass. Fuck off, creeper. You have to destroy the skeletons f for, um, the iron chains to make grappling hooks. Oh yeah, that's something I'm looking forward to, grappling hooks. Oh, that's gonna be sweet. Right, so I've not actually found any of these slimes in grassy lands, or- well, Where am I now? I'm in a mountainy place. I've only ever really found them in the desert. <laughs> and I don't know if there's a desert near me. You're not a new map. Get out of here, spider. So this is, does have an epic one-hit kill thing, which is pretty damn cool. Now all I can find is... Uh. Oh. Fuck! Is this, this. So it does seem to drop the chains quite a lot, which is uh, pretty... Pretty annoying. They seem to drop two at a time as well. It should only drop one, I think. Any demon eyes? Climb. What is that? It's just water. Let's climb up here. So, in theory, if I'm going to see a demon eye, apparently they're not aggressive. But if I want to see a demon eye, hmm. One second, guys. Okay, sorry about that, guys. Eni decided to ring me, and she was like, rah, 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 work sucks, rah, 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 rah. Yeah, she was, what was that? I swear there was some kind of explosion or something over there. Let's go over there. Oh, shit, I'm on hard. Oh, I've got the horseshoe on now, haven't I? Ha, <laughs> ha. Get out of the way, leaves. Right, uh, yes. Oh, what was it? Oh, skeleton. <laughs> Fuck you. Oh, that didn't work. Oh, shit, where the fuck am I? Damn it. <laughs> So, this sword doesn't seem to one-shot. Oops, sorry, Enderman. Please don't get mad at me. 
Oh, damn it, they were fighting each other. So what's that? I think that was a meteor. It's splashy, 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 splashy. Because there's something in this tree. <laughs> yeah, look, a meteor. I'm hoping this skeleton can't save me. Shit, that was close. Okay, so seeing as this is the best pickaxe in the game, that took a very long time. Hmm. So is it just that one piece? Oh, okay. <laughs> Completely destroys... Oh no, there is a bit more. So yeah, so that's a meteor. And they do kind of make some kind of cool explosion animation as well. Sweet! Anyway, <laughs> getting distracted. Uh, I don't think I'm going to be able to find an eye. Uh, a demon eye. But they're not aggressive anyway. Is there more meteors over here, night? Go away, I don't want to play with you. Um, no, it's just a... Ah. God damn it, there's so many. Oh, I'm on hard, and I? That would be why. Anyway, I'm going to go and show you the dungeon. Um, so yeah, uh, it's not actually the dungeon. It's it's a custom map that someone's created. I'll put it on the forums. It was on the, Fred, uh, the forum post. Uh, I'll put it in the description. It was on the forum post. But yeah, I shall... I'll, I'll tell you why I didn't find a real dungeon, and I couldn't be bothered, quite frankly. Well, there's some light over here, really, some fallen stars. No, it's not light at all. It's just the grass changing colour. Brilliant. Yeah, actually, there's some. I didn't find any natural falling stars. Mm. Oh, well. But yeah, anyway, I shall go back to the, the other map, because it's on a different save. And I shall show you what the dungeons kind of look like. It's pretty cool, trust me. <laughs> Alright, see you in a minute. Bye. Okay, right, so this this is kind of what the dungeon looks like. Uh, it's not identical to this. Obviously, this is a custom map the sun's created. Look, it even has rules! Welcome to the my area dungeon map. Okay, I can't do the map. I've already completed it. The rules are simple. Don't break any blocks or cheat in any manner. manner. There are treasures hidden in the dungeon and collecting them will make... Blah, 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 blah. Your descent easier, so good luck. Create uh, credits. There, that guy. That guy there, he's the one who created it. <laughs> uh, yeah, so there was some stuff in here. And I've already completed it, basically. But this is what the dungeons look like. They kind of got... Uh, there's three different colours, obviously. Uh, they, they, in the inside of them look nothing like this. I've, got, I've switched back to peaceful because I didn't want to die. Yeah, so... Basically, what the dungeons look like. They don't have steps, so you've got to jump all the way out. But if I remember correctly, unless I destroyed it... Down here with this little patch of dirt... This is actually... Hmm, let me just put it onto... Hard and see if I can get anything to spawn out of this spawner. Oh. It looks like a chicken spawner. Why would he have a chicken spawner down here, though? That doesn't make any sense. Give it a bit of room to breathe. Although I did... There was two two maps on the actual forum post. And there was... The other one was, like, impossible. God, how high is this fucking sand? But anyway, yeah, the reason why I didn't actually um, find a dungeon uh, is because I f created a, cu uh, a creative map. Flew around on it for uh, probably about a day, <laughs> so it seemed. It's about four days, four days, night, night and day, just flying around. I found four or five air air islands and like four villages. So you think those fucking villages are hard? These bloody things are even harder to find. So, yeah, that's why I just kind of used a uh, custom map. And I was kind of hoping this was a demon eye spawner, but it doesn't look like it, does it? <laughs> so, yeah, so there is demon eyes in it, apparently. Uh, I'm sure if you play the play the mod properly, you'll eventually find one. I'm sure if you explore thoroughly enough your map, you'll eventually find a real dungeon. And I'm assuming the dungeon are the only way to get the accessories. Did I? Wait, one sec. Did I put them in on this map? 
It just seems a bit weird, because they're exactly the same way round I put it on the other map. Hmm. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, oh, there's, there's going to be a merchant block and some other cool stuff. And suicide pit! <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm not going to commit suicide. Seems a bit pointless, really. Um, yeah. <laughs> so, I believe that's everything. Oh, with the latest version, they've added new armor. Oh, uh, they've added corruption back into the map, so corruption now naturally spawns. Uh, I didn't find any slimes. But there's slimes in it. Uh, that are pretty... Pretty similar to the normal slimes, uh, they just got a small chance of dropping gel. I know this is a very small chance of dropping gel, actually, but... Yeah, uh, so anyway, yeah, the, the most recent version, let me just get the gear I need. I can't even remember what it is now. Let alone find the stuff I need. Oh, there we go. I need string. Bones. And a crafting table. There's a crafting table. Crafting table! Can never find stuff on this thing. Right. So for the new stuff, you just put bone in the middle, and then you put string around it, and it makes like a necro necro shard or something like that. And obviously it's not working for me because I haven't updated it to the most recent version. It's like 9.7, and I'm not sure what the number is at the beginning. But yeah, then you can make... It gives you like five things, and then you make armor with it exactly the same way as you make all other armor and all that crap. So, yeah, uh, that is it for this mod. Pretty damn good mod, if you ask me. It shows a lot of potential. Uh, I'm not sure if it um, falls under any copyright rules. Quite frankly, it's been up for a while now and it hasn't been asked to be put down. So, yeah. Um, I, I hope I haven't forgotten anything. I probably have, but this is all I found. Yeah, this is my view on the mud. No one else's. Yeah. Um, my next map, uh, the next video. Oh, God, I've decided to die. <laughs> the next video is going to be an adventure craft mo uh, map. I'm not sure what one yet. Um, if my computer decides to work, that is. Uh, and I'm not sure what the next map me and Edney are going to be doing together is. Uh, probably another custom map. We'll probably try and find one that's actually created for co-ops. Should be pretty cool. And I've got something planned for when 1.9 comes out, uh, when it officially comes out, I know it's already out, it's like, yeah, you can play the pre-release, yeah, <laughs> but I'm going to see if any challenges come out for hardcore mode, if not, I'm going to create my own hardcore mode challenge. So yeah, the only thing left to say is, goodbye, forever, of this map anyway, oh, I missed, oh, no, I'm dead, <laughs> thank you for watching and goodbye.